guys, how's it going? Uh, my name is Mary. I'm moving to Costa Rica from Canada in like nine days and these are my adventures in doing so. So thanks for joining me. Um, today is a beautiful day here. Spring is in full keel and uh, for some reason or another two days ago I decided to work on a project of repairing the steps beside my side door. Uh, it's taken me a little bit longer than I thought. I was going to allow myself like a day and a half maximum to work work on it and it's been um, like two and a half days. Mind you, that being said, as a single person, um, a single woman at that, I oftentimes start these projects and then I'm like, yeah, I can do it, I can do it, it doesn't look that hard. And then after a little short time, it's like, I can't do this, I don't know how, it's too hard, I don't know what to do, I need somebody, some man to tell me how to do it. And then I stop, I get frustrated and I stop or, um, doubt myself and then I come back to it and success so all I have to do is put the uh, the main platform back on which is just a big fiberglass platform so I should be able to do that and I also sold my business there is a food truck and she is sold in the nick of time and I am so grateful uh, so that's going on too and I'm also uh, actually, last night I started freaking out around 11 o'clock at night because I realized that today is the last garbage day before I move. Um, we only have garbage pickup every other two weeks. And so I was kind of going through the house um, crying <laughs> and panicking at the same time. Uh, really trying to say like seriously can you give that away? Is it worth trying to sell it? Uh, just throw it away. And I actually didn't have that much stuff. Um, because I've been working on this for so long, but knowing that it was the last garbage day, I didn't want to leave um, garbage bags full of stuff um, for the new owner to deal with. So the other thing that's going on is me basically doing a mad scramble again to give away the stuff that I don't have time selling. Things do sell well on Kijiji and Marketplace and whatnot, but it's time consuming, like responding to messages and making appointments for the people to come over. And I'm basically selling the stuff off for super cheap anyway. So, you know, sometimes you... I, <laughs> You think, okay, I've got all this stuff, and for me it has a value. Um, but is the same value there for somebody else? Not always, and oftentimes not. So I was just selling stuff for really cheap because I wanted to get rid of it, like five bucks, five bucks, two bucks, seven bucks, um, for some pretty good stuff. And yeah, that sells, it's, it sells off fine. I just thought, you know, even five bucks is better than just like putting it out to the end of the road or giving it to somebody. Um, but now it's come down to the point where I've just, I, I have a couple friends that um, collect donations for a good cause. So I'm just like stacking stuff in the, in the living room in boxes and bags and clothes. Getting rid of all my winter clothes is the most destabilizing thing I have felt in a while. Like, I can't get rid of my wool socks. I love these wool socks, you know, like... <laughs> And frankly, those have gotten thrown in the garbage. Um, I don't know, giving away socks. Um, yeah, so, you know, it comes down to a saying, just like bite the bullet and get rid of your stuff, whatever you don't need logistically. Like, And if you feel bad about giving it away, then do what I did and find somebody that's doing it for a good cause and trying to earn money for something. Um, a couple girls I found, they are donating, having a huge... Um, garage sale and we'll be donating half of the profits to a uh, women's center um, uh, victims of violence um, center so that feels good doing that hmm let's see what else is going on um, I'm just going like a mad woman trying to get stuff together so I'm gonna finish up with this project and this afternoon I have to start weighing and measuring boxes um, to give to the freight forwarding company so they know how much to quote me on so that's gonna be a huge and daunting task so countdown begins I'll see you guys next time thanks for tuning in bye bye